with meteorologist Ryan Matouche. Welcome back, everyone, and good evening. It was a hot one today. It's going to be a hot one for the next several days. We are watching a warm and pleasant evening, depending on who you ask. I know Matt didn't like my use of the word, but at least tomorrow morning we'll be starting off nice and pleasant. Plenty of sunshine back in the forecast for the next several days. Quiet and calm conditions are going to be dominating really at least through Thursday. Temperatures should be topping out on Thursday as well. Beyond that, though, we do have a chance for some showers and maybe even some thunderstorms to move back in towards Friday and the weekend. So we'll talk about that here in just a second. Outside our satellite and radar continuing to keep an eye on these quiet and calm conditions. Really not even a whole lot of cloud cover to talk about. We are watching a few high base cirrus clouds well above our heads over there outside of Junction City, but overall we just saw lots of sunshine today. A very similar picture for Manhattan. Nice, bright, shiny blue skies out there. Maybe just a few clouds sprinkled across the region. Right now, temperatures in the middle 90s still. That feels like temperature, though. We had to bump it up just a little bit. That's because we're seeing some uh, humidity in the area. 64 for our current dew points, and that's starting to make it feel just a little bit muggy out there. That humidity is going to continue to climb at least for another day or two. Our heat index, some more values across northeast Kansas, the, some big ones, Manhattan 102, they were at 103 just a little bit ago, 100 for Concordia, upper 90s for several spots, so we're still feeling the heat out there. Uh, poor Matt pedaling along out there. Hopefully he's doing okay. We're confident he is. Today we saw a high of about 95 degrees, average of 86, so we were well above that. We did not, however, hit the record of 104, thankfully, but we might be getting a little bit on the closer side by midweek. Real quick, let's take a look at the last couple of weeks to get an idea of what our temperature trend has been like. And we see one lonely little blue column over there, but the rest all red. We've been above average or at least near average for quite some time, really the last 13 14 days. So you are not imagining things. It's been very still. It's been very warm. It's going to continue to do so through at least uh, Thursday. Tomorrow morning, we're going to be waking up into the upper 60s, lower 70s by the afternoon. Look how warm it gets. We're tracking upper 90s in several spots and even triple digits out west. Concordia could be seeing 102, maybe even 103 degrees depending on how much daytime heating we get. By Thursday afternoon, this is where things should be topping out. Now I paused our model right here at the right at the 100 degree mark for Topeka. I think we're going to be right around that value. So this is what you can plan on for your day. But I did want to show you what this model is trying to push into our region, and that's even warmer temperatures. Another few degrees by the six o'clock hour and out west, we could be seeing 105, 106 and maybe even 107. So this uh, our upper air patterns are no joke. They've been keeping this high pressure system in our region for quite some time, and it should be maxing out by Thursday afternoon. A quick rundown of our future track for us. Most Mostly sunny, mostly clear skies for quite some time. By tomorrow morning, maybe a few clouds trying to sneak their way into the far northeastern portion of the viewing area. But other than that, it's going to be a nice day for us. There's the 2 o'clock hour for you. Dinner time, still no activity to report on. Maybe some cloud cover by Thursday morning. And then by Friday, we do have those showers to possibly jump into. We'll have to wait till we get a little bit closer, but they are on the horizon. Tonight, temperatures in the upper 60s, clear and pleasant evening ahead for us. At least starting out tomorrow, it's going to be a nice temperatures for the rest of the week. We're watching 90s for quite some time. And that's right, even triple digits on the board right there. So something we want to highlight absolutely on Thursday. Friday, there are whispers that we could be seeing triple digits as well. So we'll want to wait till we get a little bit closer. What I really want to talk about, though, is those chances for showers and thunderstorms coming back into the forecast just in time for this weekend. So some good news right there and some possible relief on the horizon. Otherwise, 80s next week. Man. Looks great, Ryan. It just paint, paints <laughs> a lovely picture for yes, you, doesn't it? It's going to be awesome. Just find ways to stay cool and lots of sunscreen. Yes, that's a big one. We want to, you know, emphasize our safety factors yes. and all of that. All the things. All right, the Jayhawk back.